There's a search for answers and a deadly home invasion that happened in East Austin. Austin police say one person was killed and another sent to the hospital. KXAN's Tahara Rachman right now spoke with neighbors who say they're shaken up. It was definitely quite surprising. Andrew DeVillier says his girlfriend walked outside Sunday morning to find part of their neighborhood blocked off. It looks like it started as a home invasion. Austin police say it appears a home invasion turned deadly just before 8 a.m. off of Pecan Springs Road and Overbrook Drive. One person, they say, underwent surgery. Officers started CPR on one. One was transported and then deceased at the hospital on the way. Investigators don't know yet if the person who died was the victim of the home invasion or its suspect. Officers also say several people may have been involved in the incident. At this time, we haven't taken apart who's where and what's where it, it, completely because there's multiple facets going on right now. Nothing like this. Sharon Hernandez has lived here for more than 25 years. I really didn't understand it at first because my brother's the one that called me and said there was some activity going on in your neighborhood. She and DeVillier say over the past few years, this neighborhood has been pretty quiet. Some kids were like street racing through here. That's nothing, right? That's like very petty crime, certainly nothing like a breaking and entering or a homicide. But Hernandez hopes they can eventually move past the crime. We still have to be strong and we have to help out and keep our neighbors who know our neighbors. Tahira Rahman, KXAN News. An initial reports indicated the incident was a shooting, but officers now say it might have been a stabbing. Police say they don't know yet if the suspect and the victim knew each other.